who is 51 years old, is an IT person working in information and technology. Because of his busy work, he eventually became stressed, so he began consuming two to three packs of cigarettes a day. As a result, in 2005, he developed an enlarged heart. He was in great pain and was looking for a way to recover. When I searched the internet, I found that there is a practice called Falun Gong. I read about it, got interested, and tried it. At that time, there were no other practitioners teaching me how to practice. I just downloaded the video from the website, and then I tried to follow it. I also read the book presented on the website called Chuan Falun. I then looked for the book in the bookstore and bought it. According to the Mingwei website, Falun Dafa, also called Falun Gong, is a method of cultivating body and soul based on the universal principles, truthfulness, compassion, tolerance. People who exercise experience improvement in physical and mental health. Within two weeks, I felt the pain in my heart begin to subside and finally disappear. It was magical. My heart was gone and I was in normal health. Since 2005, I haven't had any more heart attacks. However, due to the fairly strict and time-consuming work demands, for a long period of time he rarely practiced Falun Gong. He then became exposed to the coronavirus in January 2021. Pada pertengahan bulan Januari kemarin, in mid-January 2021, I was exposed to COVID that started with my late mom. She suffered from shortness of breath, and my brother took her to the hospital. My brother called me, and I went there immediately, and found out that my mother had been admitted together with other COVID patients. I stayed with my mother there for about an hour, but she did not survive. She died at 86 years old. After that event, a week later, I started experiencing COVID symptoms. I had a high fever and all of my bones hurt. I lost my sense of smell, food tasted bitter, my vision became a bit blur, my body felt very weak, and then I had shortness of breath. I also had diarrhea and felt nauseous. I became very worried when my heart started aching again. My heart condition continued to decline. Looking at my alarming condition, my wife, who is also a Falun Kung practitioner, then asked me to practice Falun Kung together with her. Then my wife and I started practicing. We had just finished the first and second movements when my fever and the pain in my bones disappeared. It was like magic, but for the next two days, in the morning, I had pain in my heart. It felt like a sharp object piercing my left side and something pressing on my chest. The pain was incredible. I told my wife about the pain and she asked me to practice Falun Gong again. As soon as we finished the first and second movements, the pain in my heart suddenly disappeared, just disappeared. It was like magic. The next day, I started having shortness of breath. Generally, COVID patients will experience shortness of breath because the COVID virus usually attacks the lungs. I couldn't take a deep breath at all. Then that night, my wife asked me again to practice the Falun Gong movements. After we completed the third, second, third, and fourth movements, I sat down. Soon, I tried to take a deep breath. Huh, it surprised me too. At that moment, I was able to take a deep breath without any blockage at all. As if something had blocked my lungs earlier, then it disappeared somewhere. 
it was really magical. I remember that night, I felt very relieved because I could breathe normally again. Very magical. During my exposure to COVID, I did not take any medications, no supplements, or any vitamins. I just really relied on practicing Falun Gong because I know Falun Gong is good. And that even made me finally practice Falun Gong every day until now. Every morning, my wife and I practice Falun Gong, and we have been practicing Falun Gong every day since then. When I was experiencing severe COVID symptoms for about six days, I self-quarantined at home, but I did not lock myself in a room. I still did the usual activities with my kids. Interacting with my children as usual. Then our local government asked us to take an antigen swab test. We took the test at the hospital, and then the results showed that everyone in our house was negative. A unique thing also happened to Prima's in-laws regarding the coronavirus. Okay, saya mau cerita ya cerita tentang papa mertua saya. I also want to tell you about my father-in-law. My father-in-law had also been exposed to COVID and his symptoms were quite severe. He is 83 years old and his symptoms were severe enough that he had to use oxygen. My wife and mother-in-law took care of him. My mother-in-law is also a Falun Gong practitioner. She is 71 years old. She always diligently practices Falun Gong every day. I know that she has always been practicing Falun Gong every morning until now since about 2003. Well, every day, my mother-in-law took care of my father-in-law, bathing him, feeding him, changing the oxygen cylinders, and all kinds of other care. So every day, there was physical contact. Now. Even though there was close physical contact with her husband, my mother-in-law stayed healthy. She did not get any symptoms at all. And until finally my father-in-law recovered in about two months, my mother-in-law remained healthy. My sister-in-law was also in the house, and she also practices Falun Gong diligently and is in good health. The local government also required my mother-in-law and sister-in-law to take the PCR swab test at a hospital. Then they both came back negative. Falun Dafa brought tremendous benefits to Prima's family. He wanted to share his experience with everyone and encourage them to join the practice. During the pandemic, we didn't know when all of this would pass. In the midst of uncertainty, in the midst of worry, in the midst of confusion through all these difficult times, it turned out that there was still a glimmer of hope and a way we should respond to all this. Therefore, I want to encourage everyone to try to practice Falun Gong, which is a very good practice for our body and soul, and hopefully we all can benefit from practicing Falun Gong. Thank you.